Today we're diving into a topic that many of us can relate to, relationships. Specifically, we'll be exploring eight warning signs that may indicate you're in a toxic relationship. So buckle up and let's get started. Number 1. Lack of Communication Healthy relationships thrive on open and honest communication. If you find that your partner avoids discussing important matters, sweeps issues under the rug, or shuts down when you try to express your feelings, it might be time to reevaluate the relationship. Communication is the cornerstone of any healthy relationship. It's the glue that binds couples together and helps them navigate the challenges that life throws their way. Let's dive deeper into the first red flag, lack of communication. In a thriving relationship, open and honest communication is key. It means sharing your thoughts, feelings, and concerns with your partner, and vice versa. However, if you notice your partner consistently avoiding discussions on important matters, it could be a warning sign. Take finances, for instance. If your attempts to address budgeting, savings, or financial goals are consistently met with evasion or deflection, it might indicate a lack of transparency that could be detrimental to your long-term compatibility. Now, imagine you're excited about planning your future together, be it career goals, family planning, or personal aspirations. If your partner consistently sweeps these important discussions under the rug or avoids engaging in them altogether, it can create a growing disconnect. Another concerning behavior is when your partner shuts down during emotionally charged conversations. Healthy communication involves expressing feelings, even when it's difficult. If your partner consistently withdraws or dismisses your attempts to share your emotions, it may hinder the emotional intimacy crucial for a strong relationship. Remember, it's not just about talking. It's about truly hearing and understanding each other. A lack of communication can lead to misunderstandings, unresolved issues, and a growing emotional distance. If you find yourself facing these challenges, it might be time to reevaluate the health of your relationship. Point 2. Constant Criticism Constructive criticism is normal in relationships. But if you're consistently feeling attacked or belittled, it's a red flag. A supportive partner should uplift you, not bring you down. Now, let's talk about another crucial aspect of healthy relationships. Constructive criticism and its alter ego, constant criticism. While feedback is an essential part of growth, there's a fine line between constructive criticism and a harmful pattern that can erode the foundation of your relationship. In a supportive relationship, constructive criticism is about helping each other grow, offering insights to improve, and fostering personal development. However, if you find yourself consistently feeling attacked or belittled, it's time to pay attention to the red flag of constant criticism. Imagine you're working on a project together, it could be a home improvement task, a creative endeavor, or even planning an event. In a healthy relationship, constructive criticism might involve suggesting improvements or offering alternative ideas to enhance the project. On the other hand, constant criticism can manifest as a relentless barrage of negative comments. If your partner consistently points out your flaws, mocks your ideas, or undermines your efforts without offering any constructive solutions, it can be emotionally draining and detrimental to your self-esteem. In personal matters, like decisions about your life, career, or personal growth, constructive criticism involves a supportive exchange of ideas. A partner who truly cares will express concerns with empathy and offer guidance rather than tearing you down. A supportive partner should uplift you, not bring you down. If the criticism becomes a pattern that makes you feel constantly judged or unworthy, it can create a toxic environment that jeopardizes the overall health of your relationship. Number 3. Control and Possessiveness Healthy relationships are built on trust and mutual respect. If your partner is excessively controlling, monitoring your every move, or isolating you from friends and family, it's time to take a step back. One of the pillars of a healthy relationship is trust, and trust goes hand in hand with mutual respect. However, when control and possessiveness enter the equation, it can quickly erode the foundation of a once strong connection. Today, we're delving into the red flag of control and possessiveness. In a thriving relationship, both partners respect each other's autonomy and individuality. But when one partner becomes excessively controlling, it can manifest in various ways. Picture this scenario. You and your partner have a disagreement, which is a natural part of any relationship. In a healthy dynamic, 
both individuals have the space to express differing opinions, and compromises are reached through open communication. However, if your partner insists on controlling every aspect of the argument, dictating what you should say or think, it becomes a concerning sign of excessive control. Another red flag is constant monitoring. Healthy relationships involve trust, and trust means respecting each other's privacy. If your partner is constantly checking your phone, monitoring your social media, or questioning your every move, it can create an environment of suspicion and hinder the trust that is crucial for a strong bond. Possessiveness can also manifest through isolation. In a supportive relationship, both partners maintain connections with friends and family. However, if your partner attempts to isolate you, making you feel guilty for spending time with loved ones or trying to control who you interact with, it's a clear sign that boundaries are being crossed. Point 4. Emotional Manipulation If you find yourself constantly walking on eggshells trying to avoid conflict or feeling guilt-tripped into decisions, be cautious. Emotional manipulation can be subtle, but it's crucial to recognize it for what it is. In a healthy relationship, open communication and conflict resolution are vital. But when emotional manipulation is at play, communication becomes a battleground, and conflict is used as a tool for control. Imagine you and your partner are making plans for the weekend. In a supportive relationship, both parties contribute ideas, compromise, and find common ground. However, emotional manipulation might involve subtle tactics, such as guilt-tripping or passive-aggressive comments, making you feel pressured into decisions that aren't genuinely aligned with your deseries. Another aspect of emotional manipulation is the exploitation of vulnerability. In a trusting relationship, partners should feel safe expressing their feelings and vulnerabilities. If, however, your partner uses your vulnerabilities against you, turning them into weapons during disagreements or discussions, it's a clear sign of manipulation. Walking on eggshells is a classic symptom of emotional manipulation. If you find yourself constantly avoiding certain topics or behaviors out of fear of your partner's reaction, it's time to examine whether manipulation is at play. A healthy relationship should encourage open communication, not instill fear of repercussion. Number 5. Lack of Support in a healthy relationship, partners support each other's goals and aspirations. If your partner consistently undermines your dreams or shows a lack of interest in your successes, it may be time to reassess the relationship. A solid relationship is like a team where both players cheer each other on, celebrating victories and providing comfort during defeats. However, if you notice consistent undermining of your dreams or a lack of interest in your successes, it's a signal that the supportive foundation might be crumbling. Imagine you're excitedly sharing your career goals with your partner, hoping for encouragement and shared enthusiasm. In a supportive relationship, your partner should be your biggest cheerleader, offering encouragement and constructive feedback. However, if you're met with indifference or even discouragement, it could be a sign that your dreams aren't being respected or supported. Point 6. Betrayal of Trust Trust is the foundation of any strong relationship. If your partner repeatedly breaks your trust through lies, infidelity, or deceit, it can be incredibly damaging to the relationship. In a healthy relationship, trust is built through open communication, honesty, and a sense of security. However, when your partner repeatedly breaks that trust through lies, infidelity, or deceit, it can inflict deep wounds that take time to heal. Imagine you catch your partner in a lie, whether it's about their whereabouts, their actions, or any significant aspect of your relationship. Trust is like a delicate glass. Once shattered, the cracks remain visible, and rebuilding becomes a complex and lengthy process. Constant Drama While every relationship has its ups and downs, if your life feels like a roller coaster of drama and chaos, it might be a sign that you're in a toxic situation. Healthy relationships should bring joy and stability. Point 8. Unwillingness to Grow Lastly, a healthy relationship should inspire personal growth in both partners. If you find that your partner is resistant to change, personal development, or resolving issues, it can hinder the overall well-being of the relationship. So there you have it, folks. Eight warning signs that the wrong person might be negatively impacting your life. Remember, 
A healthy relationship is a partnership built on love, trust, and mutual support. If you recognize any of these red flags, it's crucial to prioritize your well-being and have open communication with your partner. Thanks for joining us, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more insightful content.